What's it like to be an African American man with a disability? I think it's tough. I have creature common syndrome, and the high ratio is in the white, the white people. My HMI is the low ratio, and I think people like, ooh, he's black, had that. And I think it's different. And I think that's, I think it's tough. It's like my sister. It's my sister. So I tell people, this is my sister. So I don't see her as my best friend. I see her as my sister. If you had to describe Ernest to the world, what would you say? Oh, man. <laughs> I can go forever on this. <laughs> I would say he's a strong person with confidence, lovable. And amazing. You achieve everything. When somebody sees you for the first time, what do you hope they think? I want them I want them to think, oh who is this guy? I like to get to know him. Not just oh oh never mind, I don't wanna know him. And walk by. I want them to think, oh, I want to get to know him. I want them to know who he is. People may not see it, or may not realize it, but I can tell. When I walk by somebody and people look down instead of looking up, I know. They just don't want to. That's the type of It's almost like they're ashamed yeah. of you. Yeah. Or yeah. ashamed of seeing you on the right. When you look at Ernest, what do you see? He's perfect. You're perfect. <laughs> There's a purpose for you living here. And I know you're here for a reason. To help me, to help him, or help somebody else. There's a purpose for every reason. That's why I look at you as perfect. In my eyes. What does loyalty mean to you? Loyalty, oh. Now, yeah. that loyalty means You respect that person. Uh, you with them to the end time. No matter how bad it is, you're still, you're still gonna be there for that person. I think she, God had get, put her in my life for a reason. So there's no doubt about it. So what's that reason? What's that reason? Uh. Well, we went through bullying. We yeah. went through a lot of McDonald's. And there were there were times when she stood up for me when I got to real confront with another uh, student. It's all because you look different. Yeah. And I tell them that it's okay to be different. Right. We can't all be the same. Right. So she was there for me. Since day one. Right. <laughs> When somebody walks by you on the street, what do you want them to do? Uh, like I said, uh, I would like them to do it themselves. Uh, go, just look at me just because, like, look, go be afraid. Just, you might find something good out of me if you look into my personality past my look, so. If somebody takes the time to get to know you, what will they find? Uh, they're going to find a lot of things. Uh, they're going to see how amazing I am. Uh, they're going to find some skills that they never expect me to have. Since we're so much alike, it's almost like we read each other's mind. Yeah. It's amazing. Like, I know there's something going on with him now. I have to text him and be like, hey, I think something's wrong well, with you. Yeah, like she, can, <laughs> she can read me. Regardless, like, if I don't say nothing, she can still read, like, like, she knows what's going on in my mind. She knows what's going on with me. Like, I don't have to tell her. No, this world is cruel. The world face a lot of bullying. The world face a lot of laughter. Laughter. The world face a lot of stare. Um, the world face where people don't want to be a friend. But only a few that will really be a friend. Make that special. Uh, don't worry about the popularity, you know, 
One and two is the best way to go. And keep your life going. Don't stop. Don't give up wherever you want. It may be a struggle, but don't give up. Just keep on going. There is so much work to life to live in. It's a motto, it's a motto that I live on, live by every day. It's, uh, it's called Persistent Level C. Persistent Level C. Think about that. Keep on going. What's the point of stopping? So, all you people out there, keep living your life. Keep being happy. Has there ever been a time where he's bugged you? Yes. <laughs> oh yes. There's only one thing that bugs me, but I still love you for it. <laughs> but no matter where we're at in public or at home or at your house, you just do this craziness air basketball thing. You just shoot. There's nothing there. You just shoot the basketball and you do that, you dribble. Yeah. Love basketball. I like to, you know, to keep myself active. Uh, you know, because whenever I go have the ball, I feel like I have to, uh, you know, do this, you know, to keep my game flow going. Like, I feel like I don't want to lose my skills, so I have to keep it. I, I have to get in that mood to, like, to keep myself going. <laughs> it's like, ah, uh, yeah. It's sticking, it's sticking. Even my girlfriend is sticking. It. It's yeah. Like, <laughs> What's your friendship gonna be like when you're both 60? <laughs> it's gonna be wild. Uh. When we become 60 years old, probably in a wheelchair or can't even walk or... Oh. <laughs> I know for sure I'm gonna tip your cane and just... just really? We're the fun of it, yes! Really? <laughs> we're gonna hey. be, we're gonna be uh, like... We're gonna do it, I still... Uh, 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 yes, uh, no, you're not gonna be, you know, can't get there. <laughs> I dealt with a lot of scare, laughing, name calling, uh, and it really hit me hard when I was young. Uh, always had to come home, complain to my dad about it. I wish I would know what, why they scared, what goes in their head, what they see, what they, what the process they get in their mind. I wish I would know that, but uh, I honestly. Don't know the death of why they scared. I just because I'm different. I look different. As I go on, as I go on, I learn to accept it. Well, not not accept it, but look past it. And I learn to like, you know what? Let it be. I'm just gonna keep living my life. I'm not gonna let anything stop me. I say she's my sister. My sister, blood. I don't care if she's white, but I can see my blood sister. Oh, no, we're probably gonna end up living together in a retire like a retirement home or a nursing home. We'll make sure we do that. Okay. <coughs> okay.